Many Muslims fast during the day, but overeat in the night time, during the month of Ramadan. Many eat more food in the month of Ramadan, during the nights, than they do during non-Ramadan time. Will they be in a position to derive the medical benefits that the person who doesn't eat too much will get? As far as deriving the medical benefits, those people who wait in the night, and we know there are many Muslims, unfortunately, who eat a lot during iftar, they eat in excess, and many of them keep on eating most part of the night, and then they fast. This is against the command of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah says in Surah Araf, chapter number 7, verse number 31, eat and drink, but waste not by excess. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala does not like the wasters. Here we know people buy food, they have iftar parties where they make a variety of dishes, it goes in waste and a loss of lot of money, which can benefit the poor people. Surely this is not the way of Islam. And as I mentioned earlier, beloved Prophet Muhammad it's mentioned in the hadith of uh, Ibn Majah, volume number four, hadith number 3349, that the son of Adam does not fill a vessel more worse than the stomach. Few muscles are sufficient to keep him on his feet. If he wants to eat more, we should divide the stomach in three parts, one third for food, one third for drink, and one third for his breath, or one third for air. Based on this, but natural overeating is against the sunnah, against the commandment of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and even he will not get the benefit of fasting. Fasting means a person abstains from food, and then has normal, doesn't overeat. So most of the benefits that are mentioned in the medical benefits, most of them he will not get. Some he may get. Sometimes, if he overeats excessively, it may cause a damage to health. It's like, I gave the example in the last episode, person eats, then he puts his finger in the throat and vomits out. So the food he eats will not make him healthy. So here the fasting will not benefit if he overeats. It goes against the principle of fasting. Good. I think that's a very uh, concise answer, and that's what we need. There's lots of questions to get through, Dr. Zakir.